hello everyone welcome to my channel so today's video is going to be an online haul um i wanted to share with you guys some stuff that i found at tuesday morning which is not very much michael's and then a ton of online haul stuff so um like amazon and um some other small businesses so let me start off with happy crafter shop i got this really late in the mail her sale was actually yesterday um, so hopefully you guys didn't miss it. I did put it on my stories. You guys definitely need to be following me on Instagram so that you guys can catch these sales. Um, because nine times out of ten, I always share them um on my Instagram. Hi Lisa, hi Cheryl, hi Sam. So let me get started. So again, the sale was yesterday. Unfortunately, if you missed it, I don't think she has anything left. But she always sells similar items like this. And I will definitely keep you guys posted on um, when her next sale is going to be. So let me open up this package. It's so weird. So it said, this is, I'm going to tell you guys how jacked up my mail is. So she said that it, it said that it was delivered on Friday. And I literally did not get it put into my mailbox until today, which is Sunday. And mail's not even supposed to be running on Sunday. Hey, Robin. Hey, Bevy. Hey, Eileen. Hey, Martha. What's going on, girl? So let's get started. This is the Happy Crafter Shop. She is an Instagram sell. She, uh, she has a shop on Instagram. You guys have to be following her. It's one of those Instagram sales where you comment me and how many you want. And then, um, you know, whoever claims it first, that's who, get, who gets it. So let me open this up. I have everything else open. This is the only thing that came today. So that's how jacked up my mail is, guys, that I'm getting mail on Sundays. All right, so this is the kit that she sent me. She's got her cute little business card. Thank you for supporting my small business. Hey, Cheryl. Yes, girl. It's a mega haul. It's always a mega haul. Hey, Poochie. Inside is a mini kit. All of those items are sold together as a kit. The rest of the items are sold in individual packs. Thank you so much for your support, Lisa. So this is her handle, Happy Crafter Shop. I will link everyone mentioned in the video below. So this is the mini kit that she was selling. Let me close this so we can see better. So she was selling these mini kits again, guys. She's going to have this stuff again. So hopefully you grabbed it yesterday. Thank you, Cheryl. I love a good haul too, girl. Hey, Debbie. All right. So this is the mini kit. You get a little sampler pack of these rainbows. And she sells a lot of this stuff individually. So this is a great kit for you to just try out her stuff. You know what I mean? And get a little bit of everything. She got these roses here. The bales that, you know, we stick on the back of our little knickknacks like this to make them into charms. These uh, iridescent heart beads. They're beautiful. Hey, Natalie. We have the clear iridescent heart beads. So this is a great little kit to start with, guys. And then this teal color, which is so pretty. You, This color is going to be so good for so many collections. For There's some collections out there, guys, that's a match with. I think this, this gives me mermaid vibes for one. And then these little watermelon ones, so cute. And you guys see all that glitter in there? Very pretty. These are different. They're like an ombre from pink, yellow to green. Very pretty. Love Venus, love. Hello, Pucci. I love your hauls. Always fun. Thank you so much. Welcome, hon. What's your name? I got to try to remember your name. This, These little ice cream ones, these are really adorable. Damn, I hate that I didn't grab more of these on the sale. These are cute. And then we have these rainbows that have the little faces on them. I was ready to buy so much in Michael's today. Good thing you ladies were there to stop me. I know, girl. It's hard to not buy too much venus oh darn what a beautiful name venus i love that name welcome girl guys welcome venus to the night out crew yay she sent me some tweezers these are perfect for picking up stuff 
um, if you have sausage fingers like mine, these come in handy, guys. And I think she had these in blue as well. So thank you so much for sending me another pink one because I'm always losing my shit. So these are the individual items. Yay, she sent me some more. Oh, these are like little Sundays. Look at how cute, guys. So cute. Guys, Carousel is Natalie. She's trying to catfish us. That's Natalie's ass. Look at how cute these flowers are. And they have those little cuts in them. What do you call those cuts again? You know when the gems are cut faceted or something like that. Hey, Connie girl. She sent me some more of the watermelons. Thank you, girl. These watermelons are so pretty, guys. Have you guys crafted for um, summer yet? I feel like summer's already all over. She sent me these little um, leaf ones. And I grabbed some from the sale as well. So I can't wait to see what I come up with with these. So um, Lisa always has some really cute stuff on her shop. These are pretty. This is the front side. It has like some glitter in it. Can you guys see that? And they're faceted as well. You see that those cuts? And this is the back side of it. So we have yellow. This beautiful mint color. Wow, that's gorgeous. I don't see a lot of mint stuff, guys. So I'm happy when I get mint stuff. I know. I'm going to do summer like now. <laughs> I'm always late. These little teddy bears. They're really cute. They're tiny, guys. They're adorable. Can you guys see that? There she goes. I got some kids coming hopefully this week. There goes Lisa, guys. She is the shop owner. These are so cute. I ordered like two packs of these from her sale. These are so damn cute. I love these. Look at how cute. She thick and stuff. This is so adorable. I love these. Oh, my God. And then these little bows. We have the white flower ones. These are so gorgeous. And then last but not least, the candy ones, which are going to be perfect for all of our collections, including Halloween. So, guys, you can come up with so much stuff with all these items. You can make so many things. The possibilities are endless. You can make dangles. You can make charms. You can do embellishments. Like, I literally will stick these on an embellishment. Um, so, guys, I'm buying way more than I can craft. But I can't wait to, like, come up with some embellishments um, using all my items that I've been snatching. So, that is the kit from Lisa, who is Happy Crafter Shop. On Instagram, I will. Yeah, she's thick. I'm going to be... Um, I'll link her below, okay? So, again, guys, she got a sale coming. She's going to have more of those mini kits. And that is a great way for you to have a little bit of everything. And then you can go ahead and buy extras of what you like. You know what I mean? So, that is from her. Let me go ahead and jump into Michael's. Actually, let me do Hobby Lobby since I have the bag right here. So, I snuck into Hobby Lobby. And I went because I wanted... To get this trim for my carousel collection that I've been playing with. And of course I end up coming out with a bunch of extra shit that I didn't need. I'm mad that I got this for regular price. But I really want to add this to my carousel projects. And I just wanted to get it over with so I didn't end up using it. But I will be using it. These were regular price $3.99. Definitely don't spend $3.99. Wait till they go on sale guys. Hey Nadia. This old lady is here for you. <laughs> You're so sweet, girl. Say hi to uh, Nadia, guys. Welcome, Nadia. And then this, they had a couple clearance items. This one was $124. You guys already know what I grabbed this for, for Halloween. I grabbed two of those. They had so many striped uh, ribbon. I just grabbed these two here. So this one's a wider, but it's a smaller. Does that make sense? So I grabbed both of these. This was regular price as well, $3.99. Um, so wait till this goes on sale, guys. My Hobby Lobby don't have it. Thanks to Debbie, she got me some. Debbie's sweet when she want to be. A little jerk. 
And then um, I picked up these. These were on clearance as well. I think Beth was showing these. $1.24. And it's clear. Um, you can see like the packaging right here. So it'll just be like an iridescent film it'll look like. So these were $1.24. I grabbed two of those. They had this on clearance. I had to snatch it. I thought it was so cute. Um, I've been like collecting stuff for Hey Pumpkin, for the Hey Pumpkin collection. And then 31 came. So I don't know if I'm going to have time to play with Hey Pumpkin. I need to because I grabbed so much of it. But this was on clearance for $1.24. Whenever I'm shopping, I'm always thinking like collections and colors and, you know, what will go with what collection. So I grabbed that. Um, these were new at Hobby Lobby. I wanted to get it last time, but they weren't on sale. Um, these were the paper studio was half off. So I grabbed these. Uh, Natalie made me an embellishment with something similar to this. And they were so beautiful. So I was really happy to grab this. You get two pieces for $2.50 when they're half off. Girl, I, I know, right? I'm going to have to put Hey Pumpkin off for another year. That'll be three years in a row. So I grabbed three of these. These add up, guys. But there's only two in there. Y'all know how I am about having extras. <laughs> so I have enough to craft and make multiples. I grabbed some seed beads, some black ones, because I believe it or not, I don't have any in my stash. Hi, Norma. That black and white striped ribbon is perfect for a night. Yes, girl, you're right. That would be perfect for that. Cute frames. Thank you, guys. So this was half off of $2.99. Seed beads can be expensive, guys. So I grabbed these for, you know, Halloween collections and Halloween crafting and dangles and all that good stuff. There's my first bag. How's everyone Sunday going? I'm so happy to be doing another video. I really wanted to craft, but I'm like, let me get my haul out the way. I have some people that are waiting for me to open up my damn package. So let's do this. All right. Oh, and I also grabbed this embroidery thread here it was 30 percent off again i was thinking hey pumpkin it's probably a little bit darker than the hey pumpkin but i think it'll blend nice you know with other colors so i grabbed that and i grabbed some of this this is some fabric guys so when i was making my um when i was altering this for my design team project i wanted to fill make this all a shaker and you guys know the roll is only like however many inches that it is it didn't fully fit and it was bothering me so i wanted to get some by the yard and i just figured to grab this one i thought it was really pretty it's like iridescent it's probably too damn thick but i think it'll show the sequence nicely yeah so that's what it looks like i'll find some stuff to use this with so i grabbed two yards of that it was on sale for like 30 percent off so i grabbed that from hoobie Luby. Let me see. I got the receipt right here. Wait till this stuff goes on sale. Yeah, it was $6.99. And then I got a discount supposedly of $4.89. It was $9. I can't stand the people at the um at the desk that cut your shit. They're so rude. They really be testing me. I'd be like, oh girl, you really don't want to do that with me. So I grabbed that from Hobby Lobby. Let me jump to Michael's. Michael's didn't have much. I did a tour with you guys, so you guys probably already know what I grabbed. You always skip Hey Pumpkin because you craft for Halloween, then Halloween, then Valentine's, then Halloween. There's just too many collections. Um, Last year, I'm proud of myself because last year I did play with Spooky by Pebbles. I played with that Cartabella collection. I played with a lot of collections, and I saved Pinkaboo for last because I love Pastel Halloween. But definitely, I think this year... I'm going to be um, playing with the 31. <laughs> Hi, Ebony. Thank you so much for sharing that. All right, let me continue. So, Michaels, you guys probably saw the walkthrough. I had to grab the sketchbook for my daughter, Amaya. Look at how pretty and pink it is. It is by Artist Loft. It was pricey. It was $6.99. But it's so worth it. There is, um, let me see, how many sheets does it say? 110 sheets in here. 
And Amaya, she goes through a sketchbook really quickly. So I grabbed that for her. Maya, here, baby. Come here. I got something for you. She just don't want to be interrupted. She don't want me to interrupt her game. Damn Fortnite. Okay, so I grabbed that. So the only reason why I even went into Michael's was because I wanted to get some furniture. Here. Isn't it pretty? Yeah. You're welcome. She's so appreciative. Um, and they gave me a $15 voucher, so I was like, yes, I'm up in there. Hey, Pen Pal Projects, how are you? So, guys, they had these, they brought these back in my Michaels because they didn't have it before. I'm not sure if it's the same name, but it's called Flex. And I got the light pink and the yellow. So, it might be different from the other ones. You guys got to let me know. But these were $5.99. Thank you, Bevy. Did they have any other colors in that sketchbook? Yes, they had, I think, like a blue. Um, Ebony, check out that video on my Instagram of Michael's walkthrough. And I think I showed the colors. I can't remember exactly what colors they were. But girl, when I saw that pink, that's all that mattered to me. I tried to get two, but I was like, ooh, I don't really want to go over. Hey, Madi. I didn't want to go over the $15 voucher. I ended up doing it anyways because of this shit right here. So you guys already saw when I was looking at this at Michael's. These were regular price, but I did use the 40% off and an extra 20% off of the, uh, the purchase. So I think I came out okay. Um, this chunky glitter tool I grabbed because I thought it would go nice with the surfboard collection from Prima. So I don't know. I'll see if it goes with that. I'm going to be playing with that this week. Hopefully today. I really want to try. Hi, Lexi. Where you been at, girl? Um, And then I had to grab this. This is that glittered. Uh, it's called encrusted glitter ribbon. Why they got to use the word crusted? But it's that canvas stuff. The canvas, you know, uh, ribbon or whatever. So it's so beautiful, guys. Look at that. Uh, ombre. Rainbow ombre. So I had to have that in my stash. And then before I was leaving, I saw this. I had to have this in my stash, guys. So you guys already know. Good thing you didn't go down that aisle. <laughs> I had to have this because it's gold. You guys know whenever, like, you remember when I did those um, Christmas trees for Christmas and I used the wood and I, like, took my punch and I went, bah! Like, I always use my punch as a hammer. And I can't be doing that. So I got this fancy, bougie-ass little gold hammer it comes with some of these uh pin things some double-sided tape and some wood glue so this was 70 percent off and that's the only reason why i grabbed it i almost bought that girl you need to go back and get it i think it's really cute let me take it apart and put it up look at this hammer it's so cute guys It'll be like that i'm gonna get my husband with that shit one day i'm not sure what this is for but you get the glue. I just really wanted it for the hammer. And it was 70% off, so I could not. Oh, it also comes with some little tiny nails. That's cute. That might be cute for a project. Let me put these little findings away before I lose them. And I really need to buy some red line tape. I need to find some. I'm so sad I can never find it at my Tuesday morning anymore. All right, let me get my little beeping. Super bougie, right? So I like to keep little shit like this in here because whenever I go to find it, I can never, never find it. And these are way bigger than the ones that I have, so I'm happy with that. But you just do it like if you're hanging up a picture frame, you know, you place your thing down and you hammer it. So let me stick. Look at these little tiny nails. They're adorable. Those will come handy in projects, guys. So let me put all these in here. Sorry. Because if I don't, I'll be looking for it and I won't be able to find it. Girl, I won't be using that gold hammer. <laughs> it will be on my wall. No, girl, you got to use it. That's a nice purse size. Yes, girl. Definitely. These will be used as, um, you know, don't fuck with me when you're outside. In case somebody run up on you. Definitely. All right. Get that there. Sorry, guys. I'm not sure what this is for, but whatever. Got my wood glue here. I just got to put this away or else when I need it, it will not be anywhere to be found. I always call myself organizing and cleaning and I can't find shit. 
Oh my God. Okay, let me move this out the way. So there goes my little bougie hammer. That fish line string may be. Oh, for hanging stuff. Duh. Thank you, Norma. That's for when I go to Dollar Tree. <laughs> I'm going to be like, bitch, I told you, give me a discount. Okay, so that's from there. Michael's, that's all from Michael's. Tuesday morning. I don't even think I could show this to you guys. Because it's massive. I got this, this, uh, what do you call this? I'm on live. Not right now, in a little while, okay? So, you know, this mat right here, I got it in black at Hobby Lobby. And it's $14.99. This thing gets so dirty and messy. Like, these are, like, glue things, and I cannot get them off. So, I'm excited to change this. I also got this. I bought both of them. So, I got the black one. Out, out, out. So, I grabbed this one. Um, I'm not going to have to take a picture and show it to you guys. But it's a workspace. It's called a paper pad workspace. You'll see it in my next video. I'll have it under here right now. I got too much stuff to show it. Um, but it has like paper on it. And I really wanted to get it because it'll be nice and clean background. It's white with the, you can see it like that. This is what it looks like. It's a huge mat just like this. And you can remove the paper. So I think that it will be great for when I'm working and it gets dirty. I can just pull the paper up and then, you know, the next layer will be revealed. And I don't got to worry about cleaning my mat and all that bullshit. So I grabbed that from Tuesday morning. Put that there. I also picked out this brayer. I've been wanting one of these. So this is so weird. All of the brayers were the same. This one was the only one that was marked down for $6.99. The other ones were $14.99. And I'm like, hell no, I'm not paying $14.99 for no damn brayer. So I got it for $6.99. It was the only one. So make sure if you see a brayer, check all the prices to see if you can find you a $6.99 one. I want that pink Fiskars one. Tuesday morning sucks lately. Yeah, girl. All of ours do. Trust me. I didn't have much. There wasn't much there. Don't show it to us from Tuesday morning. We don't have Tuesday morning. Trust me, you're not missing on nothing because they barely have anything. Hey, Lala. So I grabbed this brayer. Let me take it out. Put it in my station. Because like I said, I'm going to put it somewhere. And when I need it, it's not going to be anywhere to be found. So this is great. Like if you, if you're like gluing projects and um, it can kind of even it out. This is great for my silhouette mat. Um, For when I'm putting my paper down, I can just, you know, push it down with the brayer. You just kind of roll it like this with pressure and it'll have it on there really nice for me. So that's why I grabbed that. And you guys already know that We Are Memory Keepers is the bomb. So I grabbed that. Put that in there. All right. I picked up this tissue paper from Ross. It's got the bees on there. Look at Ebony. And then the rest of them has like confetti, chunky confetti, uh, smaller confetti, the foil, and then the whites. But I loved it for the bees. This was only three bucks. I told you guys, don't be sleep on Ross. They always have really cute things. All right, and move that out the way. So that was everything from Tuesday morning. Move my mat out the way. Okay, don't mind all that noise. All right, so let me jump into some Amazon orders. Amazon has been one of my besties for some time now. I finally got in some KS Craft Eyes. Most of you guys have seen these new Halloween ones. But if you didn't, I'm going to show you now. So I grabbed this fat one here. I've been waiting forever for these to come on Amazon. It came on Amazon a couple weeks ago, and it finally started to trickle in. You definitely don't get these in two days, guys. I use the back of an old desk calendar as a paper mat. You, you'll be having a paper mat. You'll... Um, tear off the pages for yes girl i'm doing a big b project i got mine hi amy welcome hey bath with an f <laughs> so look at this die guys it's so cute so this is the back part and embosses these little things here and then this piece where you can make it a shaker so it looks like a batman symbol doesn't it i grab those 
raining outside. I will link all these Amazon dies and whatever I got from Amazon below in case you guys want it. All right. And then there's this one. It's the cauldron. I bought the little and the, the small and the large one. So I know it looks weird, but you fold all this. You fold these and then you paper piece a bunch of them together. So maybe we'll make these on a live one day. No promises because y'all know already I'm back up right now. But hopefully this is the small size. And I also bought the big size. It's somewhere in this bag, probably. I'll show you guys. Cute bat. I need more dyes for Halloween. Yes, girl. You need to get it off Amazon. And then I grabbed this one. It is a bag topper. Is it a bag topper? It looks like a bag topper. And it puts, it spells boo. And then it has this piece so that you can make it into a shaker or is this a layering piece we gotta figure this one out and it also has stitching so i grabbed that one like that right hmm. I'm trying to see how this goes but that's that we're gonna have to play with these so i can figure it out on a live one day we got a lot of time till halloween I'm already, after I do play with my um, little summer collection, I'm going to be in Halloween mode. Cut it out seven times. I've got some bee theme kits coming up. I am so late with them. I want that boo. Save me one, guys. Don't order them all. And then um, I picked up. So all this stuff has been like eBay, Amazon, Bee Stash. Oh, Maria enabled me to get this. So, guys, I seen this shit at Tuesday morning. It was five bucks back in the day when Tuesday morning had $5 punches. And it's a hamburger one. And I'm like, I, what the hell am I going to do with a hamburger one? But Maria, who is Pink Crafty World, she showed this. And it makes a, a, a macaron or macaroon, whatever you call it. And I was like, what? I didn't even think of that. So, you use these two pieces or even these two to make a macaron. And y'all know I love my punches. They're my go-to. So, when I want to make a quick one, I can just punch it out. So check out Maria's channel. She punched it out and showed it together. I'm not going to punch it out today. I want to hurry up and get this haul done. So I got a lot of more stuff to show you guys. Okay. So this next item is from Amazon as well. I'm finally ahead for Halloween crafting for once. Yes, Debbie has been killing it. You guys better be following my sis on Instagram. She's been posting some really beautiful projects. She's in Halloween mode. So I grabbed this. Natalie and um, Sweet Crafty Girl, I believe is her name, enabled me to grab this. Um, I was watching her unboxing of some Happy Mail that she sent her. And she used some pink vellum. So I have to grab this. And it looks like a, I don't know, I don't see how this looks. Oh, it's pretty. It looks really dark when they're all together. But this is how it looks like alone. It's pretty, guys. Let me see. I'll put two sheets together. So it's a really pretty pink. I will link this below if you guys are interested. It was inexpensive. I think it was like $7, maybe less. I will link it below if you guys are interested. Again, there's a lot in this pack. It's a huge pack of pink vellum. Because pink vellum can be very pricey when you're getting it by the sheets. So I grabbed that. I was inspired by them. Enabled by them. Whatever you want to call it. All right. I'm trying to find places to stick shit. <laughs> oh, my God. Let me put it back in this cardboard. Let's do that. Can't ruin my pretty pink vellum. So, again, I'm going to link everything below, guys. So you guys can snatch it if you want. Okay. What's next? What's next? What's next? What's next? All right, I got this big bag full of stuff. All right. Let's go to Urban Gems. Where did it go? What the hell did I just throw it? Hold on. There we go. All right. So Urban Gems. She sent me my design team package for 31. 
But I had to grab some of the other kits that she had available. Um, and by the way, she should be getting her order in soon. So if you guys still want to pre-order for 31 from um, Urban Gems, Nurse Tara, you can still do it. Just message her and she will get back to you with all the information. I don't know where the hell she is right now. Let me open this. She really packaged this shit good. Oh, you sent me goodies, Tara. Tara's always hooking me up, man. Hold on, guys. She, she usually ships it in a box. <laughs> she really jam-packed this little-ass mailer. Okay, here we go. So, I had to order the other kits from her. So this is one of the kits. I think it's the embellishment kit. You get the charms, the ephemera, the puffies, and the chipboard. I'm not going to show this in detail because I did do a video showing this collection. So you guys can check out that video. I'll link it below. I don't know if you can get it on Amazon UK. You'll, I'll have to have a look. I subbed. Hey, Yards Food. I'm so jealous. We still can't get it. Oh, girl. I don't know if Tara can um, mail to you, but I will definitely reach out to her and see. Tara, thank you, girl. So she knows I love me some puffies. Um, she sent me this die, guys. This is going to be in the shop, and it's really fucking cute. Let me show you what it looks like. Um, it has these three layers, right? So it's a memory dex card, and you can make a... It just has all these different layers, really intricate right here. And then it has these pieces, these extra pieces here. So really ornate and detailed. Um, I think it's a really cool addition if you love um, memory decks to make memory decks cards. So, and this is by Studio Light. She did show me how this cuts out and it's really beautiful. Let me kind of go close so you guys can get a picture. That's it, how it looks. So to have these two layering pieces as well. Okay. And these, you can move these to anything. So it's like a single piece. So you can cut other things with this which is really cool. Sorry, I'm just like looking at it. And then there's little flourish pieces, which I love to use on embellishments. All right, let me see, what's this? So I ordered the eight by eight kit and the embellishment kit, okay? So that was my order. She sent me these for goodies. Thank you, Tara. Let me put these right here. And then this is the 8x8 kit right here. So let's open this up. Because I did show you guys the 12x12 kit already. I'm doing a video. I love when stuff is packaged in these plastics. Oh, I love it. I'm so weird. So this uh, 8x8 kit comes with these beautiful flowers. Okay. You get the chipboard. And then this is the 8x8 eight eight paper pad. And I'll just do a quick little... I'm trying to see how many pages I'm dropping stuff. How many pages of each? Let's see. One, two, three, four. Four of each design, okay, guys? And it is a smaller print from the 12x12. 12 12. These are double-sided papers. So, again, if you've missed... Uh, this collection, I'm going to link my video below so you guys can check it out. It is beautiful. So I suggest, honestly, like for me personally, I don't know about you guys. I'm not happy with just one size. I have to have numerous sizes. The six by six are perfect for die cutting bows, you know, like smaller or smaller things. The bigger ones are good for like, you know, bigger projects like altering a notebook or something like that. So every size paper has its purpose. And I like to have a variety of sizes. So if you grab a six by six, you need to grab the other sizes as well. Because it really does make a um, difference in your projects, guys. And then last but not least, she sent this to me. I was not expecting this. Thank you, Tara. And it is an envelope die. It's a big envelope die. So this would be perfect for a card. So you have this piece here. And then there's two layering pieces here. Oh, this is a book one? You can make it into a book. 
Thank you, Tara. That's badass. All right. So Urban Gems, guys, use my code Pucci10 to get another 10% off. She always has some new cool stuff inside of her shop. All right. Make sure you use my code so you get an extra 10% off of her already great prices. All right. Let's keep going. I have some happy mail from Paulina. Oh, you sent me some gummies, girl. Is this my design team package? Let me see. So, guys, you guys can use my code Pucci10 with Paulina's um, shop as well. I'm sending you some yummy candies. Thank you for participating on my giveaway. Oh, I forgot I won. I hope you like it. Take care. I hope you feel better soon. Thank you so much, Mama. You're so sweet. She's like, hurry up and open my shit, girl, so you can get your gummies. So, bolitas de fuego. This is cute packaging, girl. These are those spicy candies that you guys can grab from her. Hey, Trees. Um, and her... So, she has two shops. Okay? This is her crafty shop, Mommy and Me Little Shop. Make sure you guys follow her. I'm going to link both of her shops. All right, guys? It's very important for us to um, support one another, especially on my night owls. Like, you guys know I'm all about support. Um... So I expect you guys to be that way too. Let's support one another. It's just, you know, it's just good to just support one another. So she sent me my favorite pineapple delight. This is her family underscore sweet shop. This is her sweet shop um, uh, store. Okay. It's on Instagram. Again, I will link both. She sent me some tool. Thank you, mama. Oh, this blue is gorgeous. She knows I love me some tool. There you are, Paulina. Thank you, girl. They are gushers. Ooh. And then this purple one. Thank you, Mama. This is going to be perfect for Halloween. My nails just keep chipping away. All right. And then she sent me this. I think I won. I want to give away. I forgot about that, girl. That's sad. So this is her crafty shop where she sells crafty items. So I need you guys to follow her on both. She has some really great items. So I won this little mini figurine these earrings oh this is so cute paulina and this box oh i like this box what's in here it's like a little piece a divider it's so cute guys it's from daiso i don't have a daiso so thank you so much for that paulina again make sure you guys follow her i gotta hide my candies from well elijah's not gonna girl i told you guys did i tell you guys that um one day elijah I bought some spicy ones. Paulina sent them to me. And um, Elijah was like, I don't like them because they were too hot. And I woke up in the morning. There were Skittles. And this little fucker, he rinsed off the Skittles. He rinsed all the, the hot stuff off of it and ate all my Skittles. Can you believe that? Love all the winnings. I'm already following her. Yes. Make sure you follow both of them, guys. Thank you, Bubby, for following her. All right. Let me move my candies right here. Let me not say candy too loud. Before he comes running down the stairs. Put this here. All right. Now I got a bunch of stuff inside of here. On Amazon, I picked up these binder clips. So I was thinking Halloween, I grabbed this pack of black ones. They were pretty inexpensive. Elijah's the trip, man. I will link all these below. I grabbed the pink. Yes, girl, he is smart. I was like, what? This little kid is too much. I would have wouldn't have thought of that. I would have been like, whatever, that's hot. And I'm not touching that shit. He's like, I'm gonna eat the inside. <laughs> and the purple ones. So again, I was thinking pastel Halloween with these. I'm gonna add this to my gold stash. Okay, so I did go to uh Joanne's. Oh, this is actually from TJ Maxx. I picked this up from TJ Maxx. So I bought those uh, drawers that Natalie showed on her Instagram. They're kind of like the Alex drawers um, from Michaels. And so I grabbed these this organizer because I thought it would be cool to put it in the drawers and, you know, organize my stuff by these trays. So you get a lot of different pieces. There are some longer ones. And then there's the, the big one on the bottom. So this was $9.99 at TJ Maxx. You get two large trays, four long trays, 
and six small trays. And that's a picture of what they look like. So these would be great for organizing inside your drawers. So I grabbed two of those. They were $9.99. Now I just got to wait on my hubby. I got to butter him up so he can put my shit together. I grabbed the shred. They didn't have nothing at my Joann's, guys. So all I grabbed from Joann's was this shred here. This is pretty. It's like a blue, but it's kind of got like a teal vibe to it. And I picked up these little tassels because they were only $2.99. So that was all that I grabbed from uh, Joann's. You never know when these colors will come, you know, in handy for projects. So I got that. Guys, I've been having this stuff to haul. I should have hauled some of it before, but whatever. It is what it is. Don't judge me. Judge your damn mama. So I found these on eBay. Oh my God, guys. I'm obsessed with these. There's, it was such a great deal. I think it was $10 for all three of these. These are the yellow Sizzix dies. And look at how cute. It makes this confetti for like birthday themes. The Alex Shores are easy to assemble. Hi, Michelle. Um, I wonder if the Michaels ones are the same. This party hat here. And then this one I thought was really cute. It came with the uh, presents, the small and the bigger size. So I was happy to grab these for my uh, little collection of dice. And I just ordered a giraffe one. Oh my God, it's perfect for some story, guys. So be on the lookout for those because I think these are great to add to our stash. Let me see what else I got up in here. I got this from Ross too. Everything's mixed up. This was $3.99 and it's just a tape dispenser because I can never find my damn tape. I can never find my tape. So I figured that if I grab this, it's going to sit on my desk and I know where it is all the time. So it's really pretty and marble. $2.99 is a great deal. They have really cute stuff from this James Burke collection. So if you see it, check it out, guys. All right. I'll put that there. Okay, so Eve sent me something. I was not expecting this. Thank you so much, Eve, for thinking about me, girl. Um, I think these are the doilies that she asked if I wanted. Yes. So, guys, I'm not sure. Eve did have a pop-up sale. You can always DM her and ask her if, if there's anything that you see. I didn't say little collection. To your collection, I said. Right? I don't know. But I grabbed these doilies from her. Thank you so much um, for sending these to me, Eve. Guys, DM her if you see anything from anyone hauling it. And she'll let you know whether she can grab it for you or not. I don't think that she's selling, like, as a shop anymore like that. But, again, I could be mistaken. Of course, you know, I had to grab the gold and then the pink. So for all of you guys who are doing um, junk journals and all that stuff and, and Eileen Swap, these will be nice to add to your junk journal. Girl, I know my collection ain't little, girl. I know. I'm going to forever buy dyes and buy shit that I don't need. I don't care. It's what makes me happy. And honestly, I, I love it when you have something in your stash that you, you know, you forgot you had or whatever. And it just becomes perfect for a particular project. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what I mean. So here goes the rest of my Chaos Craft guys that finally came in. The gold is pretty, right, Lisa? So this is the ticket one that everyone has been showing. It is huge. Like it's supposed to be a bag topper. So this is the back piece that you fold over. Uh, what the hell does it say? What does it say? I can't even see. Carousel. It says carousel and it says admit one. And then right here it says tickets. So this piece you can make it into a shaker. Again, these got these dies are sold on Amazon as well as Ali guys. Auntie Ali has these as well. But I like to get them on Amazon. I did place the Ali order. Can you believe it? But I like to I prefer to get them on um, Amazon. And then this is the big cauldron. What did I do with the other cauldron? I thought I was leaving it here to show you guys. You can tell how big of a difference it is, though. I'm not gonna take it out. So Robin said you cut the seven times and this is your base.
Maya, what's going on with the internet, baby? Is it messing up for you too? Can you guys hear me and see me? Hey, Tracy Boo. Allie takes all my damn money. What did you order from Allie, girl? A ton of stuff. I'll have to show that in another haul. Can you guys hear me and see me okay? It's raining over here, so my connection is, like, messing up all of a sudden. So this is the bigger cauldron. They have two sizes, okay? The bigger one and the smaller one. Hi, Ines. Finally opening up my mail, girl. Okay, so this next one is a Etsy seller. So I was making dangles, as usual. And... You guys know I have so many heishi beads and beads, but believe it or not, I didn't have a lot of the four millimeter ones. So I had to stock up because my um, the products that I were working on, they were the ones that I had were too big and I had to have these smaller ones. So this is from the DIY supply. Yes, DIY supply shop. I have showed you guys stuff from there before. These strands are $2 a piece, okay? So I grabbed this baby blue. And they're so tiny, they're perfect for small embellishments. It hasn't started raining over there yet. It'll get there, girl. I grabbed this green, and it actually seemed more aqua than what it looks like in person. I grabbed black, of course. And again, these are three millimeters, so they're so much. Do I have a heishi bead anywhere hiding? Somewhere, anywhere. I'll show you guys the difference. You can tell how tiny it is. It's really tiny, which is perfect for the products that I want to do. Then we have this pink color here. So these are $2 a strand, guys. Look at these are so pretty. They seem kind of iridescent. Not iridescent, like transparent. So I grabbed the purple for pastel Halloween. This purple. this purple and sometimes if you can grab these they have the multi-colors because you won't have to buy so many strands you know what i'm saying so this has a nice mix of like a peachy color this is gonna go perfect with that uh, summer collection i want to play with from tarot shop the prima so this one's really pretty i like this one i grabbed two of these for some reason and then this pink one so they're all different hues of pink. These are actually speckled. I don't know if you guys can see that. So now I'm set. I think I have a white one. I think I got some white ones. And this mint color. Really pretty. So again, these are four millimeter, guys. If you guys are interested in getting smaller heishi beads, four millimeter is what you want to get. Sometimes it's hard to pick out the sizes, you know? I don't like my heishi beads to be different sizes on, on a charm. Like, they have to all be the same size or it looks weird to me, to me personally. So, that's from the DIY Supply Shop on Etsy. I also picked up some of these little clay pieces, peppermints, and then these charms for Halloween. Man, they're really, like, antique. So, y'all know I'm always looking for Halloween stuff. These are creepy. So that is from the DIY supply shop. Yay, I can make my little dangos. I'm going to have to do that ASAP. I'm going to put these right here on my desk so I can play with them. All right, so what's next? This is from Frank Garcia. So they released some new Mentopia dies, guys. And I grabbed some from Frank Garcia as well as Leela Crafts. Thank you, guys. Oh, my gosh, Annette. This is so fun, Karen. <laughs> Thank you, Karen. So, these are this is the new Aloha collection from Mentopia. And it is a really pretty summer collection. Definitely has, like, tropical vibes. So, this is the... What is it? Surfboard or key holder or something is what it's called. And this is what it looks like. It has these pieces that you can emboss. 
The collection is really pretty. I'm not sure if Debbie posted her video or not, but I know that I think she grabbed this collection. This cassette. Oh my God, this cassette is so cute. I think Debbie played with this. Look at the pieces, guys. And the dyes, they're just so beautiful. Like, look at this cover. So I grabbed that one. Hotel key. Thank you, Tracy. Tracy, what you know about a hotel key, girl? Huh? And then the little uh, pineapples. I think these are shakers. Yeah, you can make it into a shaker. And then you have this bigger one. It's so cute, guys. So these are like right on time for me to play with that um, Prima collection. I had to have this one. They're little banners. So you got the starfish, the hearts, the pineapple, and then the little tropical flower. I don't know if Frank, uh, mind your business. <laughs> I don't know if Frank Garcia still has these, but I'm going to link Leela as well because I grabbed some from her as well. And if you shop with Leela, you can use my code Pucci, Pucci, just Pucci, and you'll get $5 off of 50. And that, guys, it comes in handy and it adds up quickly. I grabbed these leaves, these tropical leaf dyes. These look very similar. They're a little bit different. Like this one looks chunkier. They're a little bit different. But this would be cute to add. To our projects or if you make can you measure what the banner dice let me see they are one two three four five inches long but you can always cut them yes when I'm done with my video, okay? Be patient. That jar got my name on it. It's so cute, guys. Look at this. So cute. Look at the pineapple. Oh, my God. The pineapple is so adorable. Got the lemon, or it can be an orange, whatever. The ice cubes it cuts out. What is this? Little fan? Like a layering piece for the fan? Yes. Look at the little umbrella for the cup. It has two different straws. And then the mason jars. So it's going to be really hard to choose between these dyes, guys. Good luck with that. It was hard for me to uh, pick which ones I wanted. And then I guess I grabbed this leaf one. I don't remember grabbing this one. So I got that one. Hey, Sandra. Hey, Alvina. So that is from Frank Garcia. Okay. This next one is from Leela. Oh, I had them back to back. So I picked up the rest of the ones that I didn't grab from Frank, from her. She had some of the ones that Frank didn't have. Let me show you what I got. So this is from an older collection. It's Kimodori Colors. But I didn't have this in my stash, so I grabbed it. It's just a little alarm clock. I love to collect these dies. This little TV. I don't remember seeing these when this uh, collection was released. Hi, Angel. You made it, girl. I had to get this one. This is from the Aloha collection. And it has the um, banners. You can fold these over and it becomes like a three-dimensional uh, banner. So I grabbed that. And then I had to grab this one. This one's by Jane. I don't remember seeing this one. Guys, it is a hot air balloon and it is bomb. Look at how pretty this die is. I have to play with this ASAP. And these are yellow. So you can tell that there's different collections by the color of the dies. There's a link for Lila Shop. Thank you. So those are all the dies from Mintopia, and they're just different, different um, Spanish, um, you know, collections that has these dies that, that go with their collections. So that's that. What do we got here? Oh, Eva, little Miss Eva, been taking all my little coins. Eva, you've been taking all my coins, girl. I'm not, I'm not ordering for a minute. I gotta slow down. Or else I'm going to have to come live with you, girl. She packages really well. You guys know Eva. Eva her shop is Sweet Crafty Gal. Spelled G-A-L. 
And I ordered some bead boxes for her, like if I really need to do that. She sells dangles. She sells beautiful bolts. So this was actually a gift that she gifted me. Thank you so much, Eva. You did not have to do that, girl. And it is a mixture of different beads for Christmas. And she has a really nice mixture of different beads, guys. I love these containers. They're so cute. So she sent that to me as a freebie. And then this is what I ordered from her. She is an Instagram seller, guys. So you guys have to be quick and snatch what you want. Or else it'll be gone and you'll miss out. Bevy, send me a link to your channel so I can subscribe to you on Instagram. Sandra, what's going on? My hubby always says, do you use your craft supplies or do you just collect them? Tell him both. You got to tell him, girl, you're in my business again. Don't do that. Okay, so there's a traditional one. And then I had, had, had to grab the pastel one. Let me put this right here so I don't lose it. Misplaced it. Okay. Oh my gosh, so pretty. I love this box. Let me cut this because I ain't got time to be playing with this tape. Okay. Look at how pretty this box is for one. Hold on, there's tape on the sides too. I was like, uh-uh, ain't none of these bees coming out in her video, uh-uh. All right. Oh, my God, it's so pretty. Look at how pretty that looks, guys. Drop my scissors, my Auntie Martha's. My Auntie Martha's fell. Tell him you're in my business again, don't do that. Naughty, not a hubby on vacation, going back on Wednesday, then free time. I've heard that before about use versus collection tell him it's a useful collection yes there's just not enough time for us to craft the way we want to like let's be realistic even for for people who don't work or whatever like life is just busy and just time just goes past us so quickly so we got some beads some uh bow beads in here it's just oh my god it just looks so pretty together guys these are great especially i don't have this in my stash i have to find these Sandra, you trying to be funny, girl? You've been too, you've been gone too long to come up on here and try to be funny, girl. Uh-uh. These little rose ones. I love this color right here. It's so pretty. This is gonna go nice with that surf surfboard collection. See, my mind is always thinking collections. And then in this one, we have a nice little mix of striped ones. Really nice mixture of different bees. Look at there's even gray and pink. These kind of remind me of pumpkins. These are beautiful. And then she even added some of these bowls. Look at how pretty, guys. Really nice selection of beads. So if you don't want to go crazy like for beads, I think these are definitely great to have in your stash. You can make so many dangles, you know, for Halloween using just this one box. He is just jelly because my boys give me my crafty money. I wasn't being funny. You were trying to be funny, girl. Talking about I found some scissors. And then this one, we have all of these beads here. I'm trying to show you guys the assortment of beads in each one. I love these matte ones. It's just like so pleasing to the eye, the way she has it set up. It's so beautiful. So we have these. Hey, is it Raina? Crafty Create? I love when the kids give me... I can't wait for my kids to get old enough to give me crafty money. So this one we have black and... Oh my God. It's cut off silver. But this actually looks like a, a different... I don't know. A darker. These black ones, I love these. And there's actually some little pumpkins in here. Look, guys. Adorable. And look at this little one. That one's cute. So again, a nice assortment of different beads. With this one kit, you can create so much, guys. Yay, there's another bow one.
really cute. Okay, and then we have this section here. We have these pretty bigger uh, flower ones. I don't have these in my stash. They're pretty. This is from Sweet Crafty Gal on Instagram. Can one of my moderators please link Eva? Again, once this video is over with, I will link everybody, guys. So you guys can subscribe to them. You can jump in their inbox and be like, hey, girl, I was watching Poochie's video. And she showed this box that I need five of. Look at how pretty, guys. I love when my hubby asked me, when did I go shopping? <laughs> and then this one has this bow and then all the purple ones. This one's so cute to me. I have not seen that one. Oh, look at this. Thank you so much, Trees. It's got some clear bows in there. We have these. So I love mixing these beads. My nails just keep chipping away. And then this black one, black jack-o'-lantern. Anyone started buying for Christmas crafting yet? No, girl, I'm not going to buy from Christmas crafting until I don't know when. I can't bring myself to do it. And look at this one. But there's a lot of people who are, um, who have bought for, for Christmas already. There's a lot of collections out right now. I can't link IG. Pucci, you want to tell me why I only have one YouTube? What, girl? I love those purple and the clear bows. So that is her box from Sweet Crafty Gal. Guys, this is a great deal. I think that this runs $15 or $20, if I'm not mistaken. But it's so worth it for the container and the mixture of beads. There's a lot of beads in here. I wonder if she counts how many are in here. There's a lot. There's There's got to be over 100 beads in here. So that is from Eva. All right, let's see what else we got in here. And then I ordered these from a Instagram, not Instagram, a Etsy seller. Trying to see if it says the name. I'll link it below. So this is what I picked up. These pumpkin ones, they're pink and they're hot pink, guys. They were really inexpensive for a strand. I grabbed two of them. I want at least two collections because I don't have any, just like two paper pads. Yes, girl, there's a lot going around. I also picked up these. I thought these were super cute. So they had, this one was like $8 and you get, there was a lot of them. And then they have a smaller pack for $2.50. But I grabbed these so I could share. And they are little cat, black cat charms. Can you guys see that? Yeah, I don't like the crepe paper one either, girl. I'm not a traditional Christmas girl. I like pastel Christmas. Um, and I don't know because last year when uh, Hey Santa came out, I didn't like it. But then when everybody was playing with it, I was like, oh my God, it's so pretty. I got to have it. So I don't know. Hopefully that doesn't happen this year with that crepe paper collection. And then... So this is her website, guys. Okay, she put a discount code. If you guys want to grab. So that's from an Etsy seller. I love that gingerbread collection Natalie was using today. I think with the gingerbread dies. Which one? I didn't see that. What's this? Oh, this was an eBay find. Damn, they hooked me up. Let me leave it on here because I'm going to put it right back up in here. So this was a eBay find. It was really, I got it for a great deal. I want to say it was like 7 or $8. And look at, they added all these cutouts. This is a pretty die. Natalie, are you still there? Look at how cute this die is. Somebody find this, this die for me. This is cute. They sent all these little extras. Trick or treats. 
I think these are all the dies that are in here, maybe. Look at how cute they even put it on foam. Wow, I never had an eBay seller do that. Damn, they hooked me up. Here goes some more booze. I think that these are the dies that are in here, but let me see because I don't remember. So cute. I have to get some of this black um, foam. Look at these. Oh my God, so cute. Thank you so much. Damn, I don't got to do no die cutting. Got some doilies here. Got some memory decks. What? They hook me up. Wow, what a great deal. And these are the dies, guys. There's a lot in this lot. Again, it was like $8. I think it was like a bid and I won it. So this one comes with all these little tiny dies. Really cute. Girl, eBay. You're not going to be able to find this. It's like one of those, you know, you know, sellers sometimes they sell like, there's not multiple sometimes, you know what I mean? I love how they wrap this. So there's this die here, which makes a witch. Like this is her hair. She got a bayang. She's got her little hat, her broom. She got a little shirt and everything. Okay, and all the pieces, the paper piece. Man, this was such a great deal. This one here. So a lot of these dies you can get off Alley, guys. Just screenshot it and then put it in a search. Little trick-or-treaters and ghosts. Yay, it has this die. Oh, my God, it's so cute. Look at how cute this house is. I had to snatch this. It was such a great deal. I could not wait for this to come in. We got the treats one that they made up. So that's cool that they showed how, you know, it looks. The boo. Trick or treat. This one has all these ghosties. And they thick. She thick, boy. Okay. I was super excited for this one. I've seen this one around on eBay. And it's always like $16 for just this die. So I was super excited to have this within this uh, set. And she did cut out some of these so you guys see what they look like. This one has a silhouette in it. So cute. A spider web one that she cut out. Oh my god, look at the skeleton. <laughs> so funny looking. Trick or treat. This one, it makes up a pumpkin and then a little ghosty. These are so cute. Oh my god. This goes to the treats. So these are what those little lanterns look like. Can you guys see it? Okay, there we go. Oh man, I'm so happy with this one. It's such a great deal. This little hat with the spider web hanging down. This spooky tree. Hi, Phyllis. How are you, mama? And then this one's really cute. You can make the make this a shaker. Spooky little uh haunted house and she put some more die cuts of some memory decks cards oh man i wish i knew this seller personally i'll be like thank you so much what a great find so that was on ebay guys oh man i was about to go crazy and try to find that uh haunted house one that was badass all right i have to get like a bin for all my halloween stuff i have halloween stuff everywhere all right. What's this? All right. So this is from Ebony. Ebony, you still here, girl, or did you leave me? Ebony is. Ebony, where are you, girl? Why can't I think of your Instagram name right now? She sells trims and rosettes, and I placed the order with her to try to take all my little coins. All right, let me move this to the side and I can show you piece by piece. Okay. Ooh, Ebony, this is pretty, girl. She's there. Okay, put, put your Instagram name. Someone link in, uh, Ebony for me, please. I had to grab this. Ebony is killing it with these fucking trims, okay? She has all kind of stuff available. Not only Halloween, guys. You have to check her out. When she sold out, she sold out. Um, I think she has a rainbow one available. 
Hold on, guys. Because my stuff's sliding, and I don't appreciate that. Got too much shit on my desk. All right, let me move some stuff around. Oh, I want to craft so bad right now. So I had to grab these. I'm obsessed with the Nightmare Before Christmas. Um, I just love Halloween. These are bomb. So look at this one. So pretty, guys. I love this netting. Ebony, you did such a great job with this. And I love these pleats. I'm really particular about my ruffles, guys. Like, I, it's so weird. I love these. So, she, I don't remember the price. Ebony, if you want to put the price, go ahead and put it on there. But, guys, she does sell these on IG, so you have to be quick and grab them. I had to get two yards of each. So, I grabbed that Nightmare Before Christmas. And then I grabbed this set. I grabbed two sets. Look at these rosettes, guys. Her rosettes are the bomb. Okay, they're super chunky. They have all this beautiful um, glitter that I think she makes her own glitter mixes. Gorgeous, guys. So pretty, okay? So she had a set that had the matching trim and the rosettes. This is the other Jack one. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. Look at how good it goes together, guys. Oh, my God. All right, let me open this up so we can see this in detail. Yes. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. Ebony, you did your thing with this, girl. You go, girl. Yes. Beautiful. Thank you for my order, girl. And then she sent me a freebie. Girl, I always appreciate a freebie. But I'm going to need a couple yards of this. Don't you sell it to nobody. I need two more yards of this. This is going to be perfect for Beetlejuice. Perfect, perfect for Beetlejuice theme. Those rosettes look delicious. Yes, girl. Hey, Tracy. Sorry I didn't see you come in. Look at how bomb. Oh, my God. So pretty, Ebony. These pleats are just perfect. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. It's so exciting. Like, this is definitely Beetlejuice vibes, okay? Beautiful. You did your thing with this. Ebony, I need to order this. Can you inbox me? And she sent me some extras. No, you did not, girl. Thanks so much, Poochie, for your support. Always, girl. So I grabbed three of the Jack Skeleton kits and then um, two of the Jack and Sally trims. And they were, the kit was $12, guys. You get the trim, a yard of the trim, and the set of rosettes is the kit. And then the trims alone for the Jack and Sally ones were $6. Okay? And look at what she sent me, Ebony. Thank you so much, girl. She printed and cut these, and I know she printed it on that beautiful-ass glitter paper that her and Debbie got. I think they got it at Walmart. Oh, my God. Ebony, thank you. I appreciate this, girl. Look at the glitter, guys. You're going to make me cry, girl. I appreciate this, like, so much. What? Thank you. I'm so excited. Why does Halloween excite me? Like, it's so fucking weird. Look at these. Ebony, thank you. These are perfect, girl. You print and cut of these, right? Oh, hell no. Nah. Look at how cute. I don't know if this coming your kid, y'all. Don't be harassing her about these. Thank you, Ebony. And look at this one with Sally and Jack. I got to get this glitter paper. Can y'all put me up on game with this glitter paper? It's so pretty. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but it's gorgeous. Like, look, guys. It's picking it up a little bit. Cricket images? No way, girl. Look at this one. I love it. Ebony, thank you so much, girl. I appreciate this. Yeah, so y'all make sure you shop with Ebony. Don't buy all my shit, okay? 
Ebony, if you buy all, if you let everybody buy all my shit, we're gonna have a problem. Let me get my stuff in here. Oh man, I'm so excited. Thank you, girl. I don't have any digitals for this. And I definitely don't have this glitter paper to be printing and cutting. Let me get my precious in here, y'all. These are fucking bomb. You need to sell these, girl. Okay. They came as a goodie. Thank you, girl. Okay, so you get this as a goodie for the Sally, for the kit. You print it on the fabric with the Cricut. No, I think that's the trend that she got. So that is from um, Ebony. Um, okay, I got one more box to share with you guys. And it is a happy mail box from Inez. Inez, thank you so much, Mama, for being patient with me on opening this box, girl. And she sent me a bunch. It's a big-ass box. I'm like, girl, what did you do? She is so sweet. Like, I don't know why she's so damn sweet to me all the time. Um, one time she gifted me some stuff from Rhoda's kit. She's just a sweetheart. She's such a kind person. All right, hold on. This box is huge, guys. So hold on. Bear with me. Oh my God, Inez. Okay. So Inez, do you still do you still sell things? I'm working on Debbie trying to find affordable fabric so it will not cost too much. Hi, Thrifty Crafter. Welcome. Okay, she's here. Okay. And that's what the hell did you do, girl? So it started because you guys know the Elote Man. If you don't know the, who the Elote Man is, something's wrong with you. You've been hiding under a rock. But the Corn Man, right? They sell these, um, he's like chip things that you put hot sauce on. They're so good. And I saw... On Instagram, I shared a hack. Damn fly. I cannot get it out of my room. It keeps coming in my room. Um, where you put it in the air fryer, you can cook it. And I was like, what? And she's like, I'm going to find them for you. So she sent me a big box, guys. And there she sent these right here. These are super cute, girl. Where did you find these? Can someone please, um, Inez, what is your Instagram name? So we can link you. Oh, my God. You sent me so much shit, Inez. She sent me these glitter glues. Wow, this is that um, glue that you, everybody's saying is really good. I still have not used mine. I have to use it. I'm going to bust it out today. These are pretty, guys. I think these are from Mexico. So she sent those. This is the glue right here. Silicone liquid. Liquid glue. Okay, so it's just like hot glue, but it's in, um, you know, it's not hot. It came perfect, Inez. It did not drip at all, girl. Yes, I'm opening this, keeping this shit on my desk right now. Because I have to try this glue. Everyone has been talking about this glue. Everyone is always trying to get a hold of this glue, and it's really hard to come across. And I'm running out of my Nouveau glue, girl. I'll put it right here. I'll open it after this video. She sent me goodies, guys. Like, so many goodies. Look how pretty this is. Inez, what is this? I know it's candy, but what kind of candy is this, girl? They're paletas, which are um, lollipops. Did you make these? Wow, you sent a lot, girl. Thank you so much. Tell me what kind these are. Is that glue good for molds? It's just like a wet glue. Tamarindo. What, girl? I love tamarindo. Oh, my God. You hooked me up. I love tamarindo. She sent these Japanese peanuts. Look at how beautiful. Inez. She sent this little um pedestal thing. I forgot what these things are called. And it has all these beautiful flowers in there. Inez, why did you send me all this? You're so sweet. Hi, Zulma. Someone sent me that glue in a swap. It works pretty good, but the smell is strong for me. Oh, with saladito. No, did not make. Natalie trying to eat my shit, fat ass. And then these little jars. 
What is this brand, girl? Is this a Mexican brand? Cute little um, containers. They're going to be perfect. Look at all this stuff. You hooked me up, girl. Inez, why did you send me all this? Look at how cute, guys. So sweet of her. Suitcases. Oh, wow. Look at this. Glitter packs. Wow, look at these colors, girl. You know, I love to do my glitter mixes. And Trish just did a tutorial on her channel using fine glitter to make your own glitter paper. So you guys check that out. Look at blue, orange, and this beautiful purple. This purple is bomb, girl. Let me move some of this out the way. Inez, I can't believe you sent me all this stuff, girl. Let me get your ass back. Let me move some of this out the way. Oh, man, I got a lot of stuff to put away now. <laughs> oh, my God. She sent me these candy ones. Thank you, girl. I don't have these in my stash. Yes, girl, that color is pretty. Oh, it's a store in Mexico. Some more candies. My kids are going to be loving this. This is a watermelon kind with real fruit. They are going to dig into this stuff. Ooh, what you send me, girl? So make sure you guys are following her. Um, Inez, did you put your Instagram handle? And can one of my moderators please find her Instagram so we can link her? I'm going to link her as well after this video. Um, but she sells crafty items and she destashes a lot of really great stuff. That's how I met her through a destash that she did. Hey, Lana. She's so giving. Wow. So generous. Look at this. Pretty trim. Yeah, that's Bevy. She's trying to catfish people like Natalie. And she also made me a bow. So beautiful, mama. Thank you so much. There it goes right there. Mio, three boys. Can one of my moderators please link that Instagram for me? Um... Inez, let me know. Do you want to sell that glue to people? Like, can you get some to sell for anyone who wants to buy some? Let me know. And maybe some of the girls can order some glue from you. Oh, my God. There's still more stuff. She sent me two glues. No, you did not, girl. You hooked me up, mama. Thank you so much. Okay. There's still more in this box. Oh, my God. This is all she was supposed to be sending me. Look at these. This is what, what um the chips are. So you put them in your air fryer and then they bulk up. These chips are so good, guys. Thank you so much, Inez. She sent me two of them. You got to tell me what kind of pique the elote met. What's the best pique to use on these? Because I like mine with hot sauce. Amaya, come here, baby. She's going to be so happy. Amaya loves this stuff. You change your name, but thankfully not your picture. Thank you so much. That is Inez's Instagram. Guys, follow her. She has great D stashes and she's so sweet. Look at what my friend sent me. You put these in the air fryer and they pop up. They're the ones that throw a look at my sales with the hot sauce. They get big. Put those in the kitchen for me because we're going to eat those later. I got to find the hot sauce for that first. So guys, tell me what's the thing to use for that. Look at all these she sent me, guys. What? The rainbow. What are these? This is a, a gift box, like a present. We have a mermaid tail. Wow, girl, you really hooked me up. I'm going to have to find a container just for these to store those in. Um... She sent me some flowers. Those are cute, girl. Yeah, that's Natalie. She's trying to catfish people, too. Everybody catfishing. Let me see what's this. Inez, you are so sweet, girl. I pray that God blesses you for your generosity, girl. I know that he is. 
because that's how it is, guys. When you're a blessing to other people, you are blessed. These are duplicates for me. Feel free to keep or give away Inez. Oh, yay. I got the other ones. Let me see. Oh, yay. This is the one that I have. Thank you, Mama. I got three gorgeous girls now. Thank you so much, Inez. You are so sweet, girl. Wow. I'm blown away. Like, there's some, like, really great people in this community. There's some shitty ones, too. Like, let's not get it twisted. But there are some really great people in this community, like, for real. Look at this, guys. What is this? Artificial tamarindo flavored soft caramel paste. Hmm. Guys, me and my kids are going to be trying these out. 10 apples. Covers up to 10 apples. Oh, you put this over your apples. Hmm. I'm going to have to try that. <laughs> Natalie's laughing because she knows there's some crazy motherfuckers in this crafty community as well. Like, let's not get twisted. Wafer with cow and goat's milk candy. What? Hmm. I'm not going to read that to my kids because they're going to be like, yeah. I'm going to be like, try this. And then I'm going to tell them you just had some cow and goat's milk candy. This is probably bomb. Thank you so much, Inez. Hi, Chiquita. I bought one of those for me, but haven't tried it. Which one? This one or this one? The, the, I don't know how to pronounce that. Hot sauce. Let me screenshot that shit. Boom. Angel, can you guys tell um, Angel she's delayed? Tell her to fast forward the video. So she's behind. Make easy candy apples. Want one of each in my box. <laughs> mm. And then she sent some stamps. These are no, what? There are no good girls gone bad, just bad girls found out. Lord help me to be good, but not yet. <laughs> friends, sisters at heart, partners in crime. She knew, she knew this was perfect for me, huh? Good friends don't let you do stupid things alone. If you obey all the rules, you miss all the fun. This is so cute. Thank you, Inez. Oh, my God. How sweet is this girl? And she sent me a caca silver frame that I'm going to paint another color, Inez. This is cute, girl. It's a frame that stands up, too. I'm going to frame paint this pink. Look at this good quality. Hold on, guys. Okay, there's still two boxes in here. Like, what the hell is wrong with this girl? Look at this. Okay, let's see what this box is. Sorry about that, Kaka. <laughs> girl, I don't mind. I'm going to paint that. Like, Girl, Inez. Look at these. Some more of the peanuts. Some sequins. Oh, I don't have this color. This looks like a bomb-ass store out there, girl. What the hell? Purple. My granddaughter helped me pack the box. Oh, how sweet. Look at these. These are cool. For Halloween. Are these beads or they're buttons? Look at some pink ones. They're little smiley faces. I know, girl. I'm going to be set on snacks. She sent some wood pieces. They all have different um, designs on them. Oh, I love these. this color right here. It's pretty, girl. Inez, I can't believe that you sent me all this stuff. What is this? My sausage fingers. They're little Lego blocks from Daiso and an embossing folder. Wow. Thank you so much. Girl, what the hell? I can't believe you sent me all this stuff. And there's one more box, guys. I got a tinkle. I got a pee. Okay. So this is the last box. Look at how big it is. What the hell, girl? I swear, like, I'm blessed with, like, so, much, so many good people, man. 
I have the best friends. Girl, you hooked me up with these with these uh nuts. So she sent that. She sent this here, this little carriage. Look at how pretty it is. And it has some flower rosettes in them. I need to make the shipping worth it. I know, right, girl? I've never been to what well, I've been to one of their store locations when I was on the Mexican cruise. The store is massive and it's like a fabric craft store with great deals. Look at all this stuff, guys. She hooked me up. Look at this. I never had one of these. They're like a marshmallow, right? Chocolate covered marshmallow. And I love these. Look at how delicious. Oh my God, you sent a lot of them. Inez, thank you so much, Mama, for everything. I'm going to get your ass back, okay, when you least expect it. Um, it's going to be a surprise. But thank you guys so much for that happy meal, girl. You made my night, like for real. I'm about to, um, I got to tinkle, guys. I love you guys, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.